What it do ski, it's your boy Farewell34 and today we're checking out Merlin season number two, episode number four. Things have been turning up. Morgana has been extra shook than normal. Uh, and let's just continue on and see what's popping today. So as always, if you enjoyed this video, then definitely be sure to smack that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, and with that being said, let's get her going. Yates. Merlin. Oh. Get out of bed early today. Sad boy hours. Morgan is on a pilgrimage to her father's grave. It sounds more like she wants to go learn about the you druids. You look troubled, Gwen. I'm beginning to think there's a man involved. <laughs> when do I get to meet any decent men? Oh! We're about to get raided. You must follow me. Oh, <laughs> to hell? I don't know about that one, buddy. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, we're starting this one off hot. <laughs> this one off hot. Let's see where this one goes. RIP to their men though. They had they did not stand a chance. Lancelot. Oh, returned. Gwen's doing that. At least turn your box. So you can make a run for it. Oh. Ooh. That's a bad time to roll an ankle. I'm not leaving you behind. Guys. Gwen? He left us. A note? It's a ransom note. What are you going to do with me? Hingis has never met the Lady Morgana. For all he knows, you could be with the Pendragon's ward. We can't abandon her. How many men would you have me sacrifice to save a servant? As many as it takes. Arthur's gonna have to do some convincing. Gwen gave herself up so that I might escape. I don't want her honored, I want her rescued. We cannot give up hope. You have to do something. My father's right. Fred, there's nothing we can do. It's gonna have How to be a search party. That? Solo operation. So Lancelot's gonna be here and save her. Quinn is the most kind, loyal person that you would ever meet, and she has been more than a friend to all of us. And you would leave her at the mercy of those animals. Have going. you no shame? Do you think of no one but yourself? Do you not see him packing? <laughs> Perhaps if you would stop shouting at me for one second, you would notice that I am packing. You're going after Gwen. Of course I'm going after. What'd you take me for? Don't even think about telling me not to go. <laughs> for a second, I forgot it's Merlin's show. <laughs> I'm living for these Merlin and guys hugs these past few episodes. You distract the guards. What? How do I do that? I don't know. Don't do the nay nay. Do you see that? The, the, the barrel just... It just stopped. Are you sick? Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> A lot of yelling. Let's go, Lancelot. Our royal guest, Lady Morgana. <laughs> My lady. Rufus? Impossible? <laughs> Was not expecting that. Okay. This guy Merlin's Bunzo. Oh my goodness. He's gonna snap his neck. What the fuck? What are you doing? Thank you. I feel so much better. Guinevere's life is at stake. As an evil. Cannot evil. afford to waste a second. I could not believe my eyes when I saw it was you. I thought my mind was deceiving me. Why does Hengus think you are Lady Morgan? What became of you after you left Camelot? All right, so check opportunities it. for men like me. The world is not like that. I still see the hope in you. I do not accept it as gone. Arthur's gonna roll up like Gwen. I came to save. Oh, I have thought of you often. It's Lance. I thought I would never see you again. Someone's coming. All right. No matter what it takes. <laughs> Sleepy Merlin. I was informed that the king was. Extremely fond of his ward. Cut through the tunnels of Andor. Tunnels of Andor. That does not sound fun, nor safe. Oh, they're really bad. Perhaps you prefer to be eaten alive. Hey, pass me some more, will you? 
Okay, from this angle, they're kind of cute. Then you have given me a reason to live. <laughs> Alright, we're holding our hands pretty tight. Be ready. I know it might be chilly and all, but... Well, what's that wilderness eating? It's alright, it's just Merlin. He's trying to get us both killed. They do say love makes you do strange things. Oh, shit. What are you talking about? It's so obvious. A blind man could see it. How can I admit that I think about her all the time? All the time? Or that I care about her more than anyone. More than anyone? How can I... Here we go. We'll push... You? Press because of the gas. Nothing... Relationship advice hat on. I promise I will make your life a living hell. More than you already do. <laughs> Poor Gwen. Lost her dad. Is in the bin again. This guy is sick. Thank you for being so honest. See ya! Control all the building. No. They have busted out the bin. They are fleeing. This tunnel, it will take you out beyond the castle walls. I would die for you 100 times over. <laughs> Live for me. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. My feelings for you will never fade. Oh boy. Run. Run. Knock on the front gate. I'm sure if you ask nicely, they'll hand Guinevere over to you. Was that a name? Huh? A serving girl. Hey, Dad. Good. How are you? Uh, what? Things are good. Guinevere just left. Guinevere just left. Guinevere. What? Oh my God! She didn't even get away. No. You failed her. It's kind of crazy. It's harder than it looks. Oh, now you're just showing up. How do I distract them? Get a couple of barrels. It's a funny story. I was out walking and I, I took a wrong turn, and here I am. It's him you need to worry about. Hmm? <laughs> that actually worked pretty well. Undercover boys. Third time's a charm. Oh, okay. Yeah, are none of his guards gonna hop in? I came to save Gwen. What about you? Same. Merlin? Take one of it. I'll hold them off. No. What are there? You have to go. I see you still up to your old tricks, Merlin. Good to see you both. Where your knights? It's just us. <laughs> Merlin's just like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Arthur's not gonna like this. She's alive. I'm glad. I'm surprised you would undertake such a rescue mission with just the two of you. Father would not risk the lives of his knights or servant. And yet you disobeyed him and came here anyway. Read the room, brother. I think I'll get some rest. For sure we'll get some rest. I'll stand guard for a while. I'll just sit here. <laughs> sit here then. He has feelings for her, doesn't he? What about you? Do you have feelings for Gwen? Surely Gwen My must be awake. Do not matter. And they're not that far away. I will not come between them. Tell Gwen that she has changed me forever. And you're grateful? But some things cannot be. Where is he? He's gone. No. He wanted you to know that you've changed him forever. Gwen. Someone here to see you. Gwen. You. Really are a complete idiot, aren't you, Merlin? 
Money. And that was my reaction video to Merlin season number two, episode number four. This one was Lancelot and Guinevere. A pretty straightforward plot. Morgana and Gwen are gone to go visit her father's grave. They get yeeted. They get yoinked, actually. My apology. Sort of where the things go here. And I actually thought this was a pretty good episode. Just a pretty standard good episode all around. Uh, I think they progressed Arthur's feelings for Gwen, him committing to go and retrieve her. I like actually one of my favorite parts of this episode other than the reintroduction of Lancelot, the, the pairing of Arthur and Merlin and him helping him out, you know, trying to figure out how he feels, letting it off his chest a little bit because obviously he hasn't been able to talk to anybody about his his feelings for Guinevere, and as we saw this episode, they're pretty serious, right? And you know, Merlin gave him, you know, the the idea, like, you know, maybe once you're king, you can change things, and you guys can be together if she, you know, if things work out here. Lancelot popping up here was a surprise. There's a, a great character who came in, in in the first season. Uh, I liked his introduction, and then he came back again here, grinding his way up the ranks, uh, or at least trying, just surviving essentially, because he's a skilled fighter. And we saw that displayed here again. He was knocking down quite a few people here to save Guinevere, and I actually thought the moments between, because I think they, they did tease them too as well, I think in in the in this first episode, so in the second episode, it makes sense. By the end of this one, it's been solidified. They are a thing. This traumatic experience, obviously here being thrown in jail, which is, you know, awful as always to see Gwen just in peril and just going through it. It's nice to see her and Lancelot there, and I actually like that sort of love triangle here. They pitted this episode where it was Arthur, you know, accepting potentially him and Gwen can be a thing only to have Lancelot pop up and Lancelot being the respectful guy he is uh, just peace and out. You know, I said at the beginning of this episode, it almost feels like we're not even watching Merlin's own show because I feel like he's been taking the backseat a little bit here. But for this episode, he definitely was just sitting down watching everything unfold, giving his, you know, two cents in a chain when it came to Arthur's relationship here. And, you know, it was fine. I liked seeing the happier Merlin, you know, he's been going through it a little bit as well here. So I liked him, you know, just playing around. I like the bonding too. And I like them just focusing again that, you know, despite him being his servant, they are good friends and their, their relationship is improving as the series is going along again. Him confiding in him, telling that he does like all hope isn't lost. There is still a chance. Uh, yeah, I thought this was just a nice, fine episode of the show here uh, by the numbers villain, but they're pretty, you know, animated and I think compared to some of the previous ones here. Yeah, so I thought this is a pretty fine episode of Merlin here. Progress ideas brought back Lancelot in the mix. Had some good back and forths with Merlin and, and, and Arthur. Anyway, guys, that was Merlin season two, episode number four. What'd you guys think about this episode? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments section down below. Was a Lancelot kiss better than the Arthur and Gwen kiss? Let me know. I thought they, I thought it was a pretty good lineup for that one. And uh, both of them, I feel, have feelings for each other. Um, so we'll see how Arthur is going to take, how Arthur and Gwen's relationship is going to go moving forward here. Are they going to just do like sort of the back and forth? I'm not entirely sure. But with that being said, I will see you guys in the next one. Love you. Peace.